Okay, guys, I was able to claim my Kotadao token from the Satoshi app. I know many people are facing facing issues on how to claim their own Kotadao token airdrop. In this video, I'm going to show you the way that I use the the the, the step that I follow before I was able to claim my own, I think 33% of the token uh, given to me. As you can see it here, get 29,918 of the CTO, Cortadao token, not yet listed, but very soon they are going to list it. But many people are facing issue, they don't know how to claim it. When they click, on the uh the link to claim it it's not loading for instance let me show you how it look on uh chrome for you even though if you come to your mental mask app it will not open also it will not open let me show you first for instance on my metal mask here i go to the browser here and i search the name of the of the page so this is what it, it, it showed me it returned me to home page i research it again still nothing is going nothing is going how will you do it because if you come to your, your chrome and you see it like this here even though when you click on connect it will not go to anywhere it will not go to anywhere if you go to your mental mask direct metal mask app and you do it there it will not go so this is what you are going to do go to your play store or apple store and download kiwi browser for instance this is kiwi go to your play store or apple store and download kiwi browser kiwi browser so log in through kiwi browser go to your kiwi browser and make sure you download kiwi uh extension for metamask metamask extension kiwi browser metamask extension <laughs> chrome metamask extension just search it on play store like this on play store search it on google 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 chrome uh kiwi okay let's use metamask 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 chrome extension so that is what you are going to search so just click on it and download it metamask and download it from the upper one or check the down one so this is it here so just add click on add extension add to chrome you will see add to chrome here yeah, click on add to chrome i have already done it so when you do it and uh, you check here you will see the meta mask down below here you can see it here that is the meta mask i just add to chrome on your met on your kiwi make sure you do this on your kiwi if you are using system you can just it will be easier for you but if you are using phone you can just use kiwi kiwi browser so after that you will go to your metamask app metamask app go there and copy your private key or wherever you put you you you, you store your private key go and copy it let me show it to you so for instance this is your metamask now go to settings here to search for your to get your your private key where is it where is the private key we'll go to security and privacy here so when you go here you are going to you can see your private key here you can see it you can review your phrase here your phrase and so on so on so on click here show private key click, click here show private key and make sure what 
the private key of the metamask you want to use is the one you have for your core blockchain your core blockchain if you don't have core blockchain on your metamask this is how to get it click up here because normally when you open metamask for the first time it will show uh ethereum network here so you have to add core blockchain there if you don't have it click here and click on add now click on custom for those people that don't have it just follow this custom network so here input core here input right core here in capital letter here you need to input let me find it maybe i still have it i'm not having it here so i will drop what you are going to put here i will drop everything in the description of this video so just check the description of this video everything you will drop here you will see them the description of this video so after you drop everything then you click on add so immediately you click on add then your network the core network will be add to your metamask so after it's hard to your metamask then you can now go and copy your private key for those people that don't have core there on their metamask but if you have it just click on call uh, account on your metamask and copy your private key so after you copied your private key back to the kiwi browser and go to the metamask down wait for the metamask to load wait for it to load and register they will ask you to import your accounts your private key or create a new one all you need to do is to click on import i have already imported my own so click on import so after you click on import a uh, private key to log into your account here on metamask so after you log into your account with your uh, core private key click up here and make sure you, you, you it is the the same core blockchain the same core address on your metamask app and you see that you are seeing here make sure it is the same thing that you are seeing here make sure it's the same maybe this address you can just check it this address make sure it is so this is one is for my core you can see the same balance of the core i have there is also the same i have here so right now we have changed everything to core now the next thing to do is to go to the core tadao airdrop claiming page search for something like this airdrop.cortad.io like this i think you should show it to me like this so right now they will ask you to connect your wallet make sure you have at least 0.1 core on your wallet 0.1 core on your wallet that is not even up to one cent dollar so make sure you have up to that now click on connect wallet so when you click on connect wallet it will show you this i have already done my own that is why it's showing me uh connect to another wallet you can see already clicked so you can see that i've already clicked so from here you can now follow the step by step so immediately you click on that connect wallet they will ask you for sign in so you have to go back to the wallet here again wallet here again then you you will see the information there they will ask you to confirm a sign up to approve it approve it and come back here again to do the necessary one again then you go back to the wallet again to approve it here on the activities you can see it here on these activities here you can see how many call the, the dots the dot 0.1 call as a transaction fee you can see it here confirmed so this is where i do everything that is how you are going to connect your quarter dial uh which is your cto to call to get your airdrop 
that is just how to do it if you don't still understand this video you watch it again and so that you can understand everything perfectly it's very simple it's very simple if you have your core if you have core wallet on your mental mask just copy your private key there take it to kiwi extension mental mask and import it log in into it make sure you have at least 0.1 core as you can see it here as you can see it here make sure you have that then after that go to your cutterdow.io that is a airdrop.cutter.io then click on claim claim there so after you click on claim you will come back to this wallet here to confirm the uh the sign in confirm the sign in then go back there again to do the rest finish that is all and you can go back to your metamask app and you are going to see the wallet the the token you claim you are going to see it there if you want to see it here you need uh the contract address to see it now let me show you how to show the token here click on import import token to import token you have to input contract address of the cto here input it here the quarter down uh, contract address put it here this contract address i will also drop in the description of this video input it here and click on next you can see this is it here this is the total of the token i have now click on import you can see it now the token has show up in my balance that is how to do it for those people that don't know how to do it that is just how to do it so guys i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to the channel so that i can keep on feeding you with a good update like this so that you will not miss any of your airdrops so guys thank you for watching see you soon in my next video goodbye for now